Hey guys, my name is Michaela, but you guys can call me Mickey. I hope you're all having a great day so far. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how I'm going to use one of the best hair irons to get my hair done for the day. For those of you who live in Florida, like I do, you know that the weather here is bipolar and it makes no sense. One second, it'll be super sunny and then it'll start pouring rain five minutes later. So there's a lot of humidity and a lot of stuff that can mess with your hair and your whole vibe for the day. It is important to me having curly hair to find a hair iron that could flatten this out, maintain it down and maintain it for the whole day and for even longer. Usually when I share my hair, it lasts me for like a week. So. Buying a hair iron is actually the best thing you can do. Hair irons are super easy to use. They're at home so you don't have to go and spend a whole bunch of money to go get your hair done at the salon hair irons are super easy to take around to travel with you can take it on vacation you can fix up your hair in the bathroom when you go out or it's just like a quick little touch up you can take it to your friend's house when you're getting ready you can just take it anywhere it's the best thing ever so without further ado i am going to introduce you guys to a hair iron i've been using for quite a while now the Innova Professional Flat Iron. Not only is this flat iron super simple to use, you just have to turn it on right here. You can go up the temperatures and the temperatures go up from 122 to 455 degrees Fahrenheit. That's real hot. One of the very first things I noticed when I got this hair iron and when I use it is that it's super lightweight. So you can easily take this with you anywhere you wanna go. It's not that big. You can fit in like one of those big purses. The wire, so you don't have to like strictly hold it some way you can literally just like go around your hair and it's really easy for like I want to do curls what's super cool about this hair iron that I found out is that it really locks in all the moisture that's already in your hair and it actually heats your hair and your cuticles evenly this allows you to just kind of not have to go over and over again on a strand and you can just do it once or twice real quick and it'll be straight and something that's also really cool about this is that i don't know if any of you will have ever left a hair iron on when you've left on a rush or had to go to work or school or something and you left your hair iron on this one actually shuts off after 60 minutes of being on so you don't have to worry about your house burning down right behind. don't leave your hair irons on try to turn them off but this one at least turns off by itself if you haven't used it for 60 minutes so. i'm gonna go ahead and i'm gonna show you guys how i use this and how my hair turns out i'm gonna show you a little before I'm gonna do what I usually do. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna rinse out any product that I have in my hair and then clean my hair. Boom. All right, so we're gonna get this hair out. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and get my comb. Comb. And I'm gonna brush through my hair tip start from the bottom and go up so you're not ripping your hair out i recommend combs especially for curly hair so now that i have combed through my hair i'm gonna go ahead and grab the heat protectant that i use so of course always use heat protectant when you're using heat on your hair it prevents damage so i'm gonna go ahead and get my heat protectant that i use into my hair and i'm gonna spread it evenly and you want to focus on your ends i was told that it is best to put it um through the ends so that you're protecting your ends from anything that's damaged from the heat and spread this evenly out brush my fingers through my hair i have layers so i have to make sure that i really do go like up Roots as well to be safe. Mm. Got it. <laughs> Usually I like to let my hair air dry. For the sake of this video, I'm gonna go ahead and dry. Warning, it's gonna get wild because my hair gets really big when I dry it, so. I just usually just split my hair into different sections. I 
officially split it into two different sides. Okay, so here's something that's also awesome about this hair. I see, so it says off, right? So I turn it on, right? And I put it to my desired temperature. So I'm gonna put it to, let's do 373, right, watch. So it's gonna, look how fast it goes up. And you can immediately start feeling the heat and the iron. So for someone who lacks patience, this is great. It has reached the desired temperature. Let's do this, actually got a little less hair. Of course, let me get it closer to the root. And then just fall down. Could you look at that? That's already with one. Mm. I'm gonna pass it slow so it does cover the hair. Look at that. Well, my, my bottom hairs usually are the ones that are like more stubborn. And this one's really good. Okay, let's just do more hair. Look at that. It glides so easily. I have a lot of hair. So I'm gonna like do most of it and then kind of show you more towards the top where there's more hair and usually the hair comes out like smoother. And then I'll show you the end product. Okay guys, so I finally made it to the part where I wanted to show you guys more of how it would look. Guys, look at this, look at this shine. And I kid you not, this took me like 20 minutes to do. The shine. No frizzes on the side. I just started doing this side of time, right? but it looks good. This is why I love this hair iron. Yes, there it is divided. We shall continue. See, this is where we start looking kind of weird. I've got like that unicorn bun. It's fine. I'm about to show you this part. Do it like this. And split it, and then we're gonna comb it. I'm gonna go ahead and grab this piece and so slide it. And I'm gonna cheese two passes of the hair. And I took off my earrings because it was kind of getting in the way of like, doing the hair, so I kind of have to. So, this is what, and I usually grab like my wig. Like, two. Look at that. Not even one minute on the shine of hair. And mind you guys. Many tips I have said in this video. I'm not a professional hairstylist, but in terms of tips, you know, I've gotten them from from professional hairstylists from hair salons, people I've been going to for years. All right, so I just basically wanted to show you guys the kind of look of more towards up my hair because for some reason the bottom of my hair, like, it's weird when I straighten it. Now I'm gonna go ahead and finish all my hair and then I'll show you the and here it is all done guys look at it it looks so good like it is so shiny it's literally pin straight my hair feels super smooth usually i put like oil on my hair after but i don't think this means any i'm ready to seize the day look at that oh, i feel so pretty all right guys, that's it for my video. I really do hope that you found it helpful. Again, I do highly recommend the Innova Professional Flat Iron. It's honestly one of the best things I have gotten so far. Please feel free to leave any feedback, any tips you guys have, any comments. If you do end up buying the hair iron, please let me know. I wanna know how you like it, what you like about it and any tips that you have on using it. Next video I'm gonna do is how to do beach curls for date night. For that, I'm also gonna be using one of my favorite Inova professional hair products. So stay tuned. Have a great rest of your day.